old school trail. So these ones are all locally just kind of made and trimmed up and used, right? Ooh, hairpin. Hey everybody, I hope you're doing well. Welcome back to Rob on Bikes. So today's video is gonna be on a little bit different of a ride. For years now, my brother and I have enjoyed these locally grown and cared for off the grid mountain bike trails uh, near the Lionel Lakes area of the Twin Cities. Now these are pretty mellow trails. You're not gonna find any big features or tough technical sections. Oh, jeez! Oh, Holy cow! Don't take Lionel Lake trails lightly. Yeah. I guess that's also part of their charm. They offer an easy portal into the forest and lake shores of this suburban community. Got Centerville Lake here. Hello. In the fall of 2021, Pathfinder Trail Builders actually came in here and built some mountain bike purpose single track trails. They kept it mellow, nice flow trails approachable for the entire family, with a couple small jumps to keep it fun. Pathfinders built two separate sections, each just under two miles long. And here we are approaching the entrance to the first section. Oh no. Oh, that sucks. <sighs> well, that was supposed to be the subject of today's video. Yeah, but you know what they say. When life hands you lemons, make lemonade. Or, if you're out in the woods, look for mushrooms. And once you know it, the brothers got quite the eagle eye for mushrooms lining the trail. Oh, there you go. I gotta figure out that guy is. What is it? Orange capped bullet. I think it's edible. Well, we won't eat it today. Nope, not this one. We don't know for sure. Chicken of the woods. Chicken of the woods. If our, uh, the new Pathfinder built mountain bike trails aren't open, we at least gotta find some edible mushrooms, I guess. Chicken of the woods. So this is good stuff. Yeah. Huh? How do you make it? Put it in egg flour and just fry it up like a fish. Just then pan fry it. Egg and flour. That's how we do it. I'm sure there's zillions of different mm, ways. Yeah. Greg, you have a very discerning eye for mushrooms. It's amazing you don't go off the trail more often. <laughs> it's up high. We're gonna bring a pole saw. Okay, come Ooh. On. Ooh, these are good sized ones. Clean them up when we get home. So this one's open. We're hoping the next one is open. Rice Lake single track. So this is more on the western, this is more of the western one in here out of the two. Not a big parking lot anywhere around, so it, I don't think it's ever gonna be super busy. Ooh, that's soft. <laughs> don't fall off. I got some redemption there. That's where you normally go. Okay. Normally go there, but we're doing a little. Oh, yeah. New trails they signed out. So, it's kind of weird. I don't really understand it. Like, it's very close together. They're just walking over this one and then just go down. And... and it's a little swooper. Is it just these two, then you come up? Yeah. Oh, it's just hard to get any speed. Yeah, that was close, but not quite. That was kind of a nice berm there, actually. That's a fun little flowy spot. 
Was that ever there? No, okay, that's all new. Couple little jumps, that's fun. That's it. Nice. It's awesome. And so now we can just loop it again. Oh. Whee! Oh yeah, oh, coming in hot there. Cool, that's awesome. Hello. Oh, what are those? See ya? Yeah. Cool looking, huh? Cool. What is it? Crown tipped coral. But uncommon species in North America. Uncommon species in North America. Here we got them. Or edible, raw, or cooked. Edible, raw, or cooked. Huh? So on the heels of our mushroom hunting success, we tried our luck back on the first trail that had been gated off earlier. Looks close to me. Still closed. Well, that's too bad. Might as well stick to what works. Ooh, look at those shelf ones over there. Yeah. That's a monster. You okay? That's a big one. Uh, let's cut that thing down. Take it home. Look at all those, Greg. Little guys. Holy. Yeah, all in all, a great day on the bike. Thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.